<laughs> oh, Kevin. Oh, you are funny. You really are funny. I imagined it would happen within one to two weeks. Soon as the opportunity that was going down. She's not immune for an hour. See, oh, and that's what I was, I was just talking actually. And then Cindy goes home on her birthday. Yeah. This season is. But I knew that was. Like, do you think? Oh. Do you think that power helped her or hurt her? Hurt in the end. Mm. See, I think yeah. After the second week, because of the dictatorship, it started to me to I could see in the house it was like a real red flag mm -hmm. was being raised. It was mm -hmm. putting target, 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 yeah. target, target, target. It just kept going higher and higher. As soon as higher. it's up, she was gone. See, I don't know, like, would she have been out maybe week three, week four, or week five? Like, you think she would have been out before? Well, I guess it would have depended who, like, because if you look at Dallas Cass, Gary could have, but yeah. it just depends on who was in power. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's true. Like, really. Um, but I knew that once the thing was up, yeah. clock was ticking. I feel like she had an advantage whether or not she had her immunity just because people obviously respected her and on her season, mm -hmm. she apparently played well. She was my favorite on her I mean, season. I wanted her, I thought she was the one that should have won. Yeah, she so wasn't she my played favorite well by any means, and but I thought she, she was strategic won. and all that good Very stuff. Much. So I think coming in, she already had the advantage of being Meta, mm -hmm. just like coming in, Cassandra already had a target on her back. So I think some people come in with less of, in my opinion, less of a chance than other, and they have more stuff to prove or less stuff yeah. to prove because they're just them. Netta walking in, we, sh she was already everyone's favorite. And she, because she's everyone's favorite and because you saw her play and because you think maybe she's going to play alike or whatever, yeah. you automatically just assume that she never lies, that she's honest, that she's loyal, that she's all those stuff just because... You see her play, and that's what you think. And the, the other people, <laughs> so I think she came in with an advantage. And then she got the immunity, and then it was like, oh, okay, well, not surprised. And then... Mm -hmm. See, and, like, when you and look at popularity, left. like, honestly, I, as a fan, she, I thought she should have won, but I thought maybe Cass or Gary would have got it. Maybe you... Me, like, I didn't there was a, a lot of you that I thought out of, out of as all a the fan. Now, I'm not being a player. I'm yeah. being a fan mm -hmm. of people that I watched on the show that I really thought, oh, I really like that guy. I really like that woman. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it was a toss-up to me. Mm -hmm. I thought it would be Netta, Gary, or Cass, in okay. all honesty, because I felt That's like the, thought, yeah. the three were the most loved, in my opinion. Yeah, no, you're right. I didn't think Bruno would get it or Kevin. I, kn I knew I had no, no shot. No, no, I, I knew for sure I had no shot. No. I knew I was kind of, I thought I was in that middle tier. I thought it was Gary, Cass, Netta were the real people yeah. fighting yeah. for. Uh, yeah. Aika sure. maybe had a shot. Mm, no. Yeah, no. I knew I knew I didn't have a shot. Uh, I didn't think Kevin or Dallas. I thought us three. Yeah. Oh, no. Uh, no. Dallas, I thought you no. three were at the bottom, and yeah. then maybe in the middle would have been like Ica and Cindy, maybe, yeah. but the top three for Cindy? sure were like. No. Cindy? No, Cindy. I, I don't think Cindy had a show. No, no. Cindy she was in the bottom. No. Yeah. no, no. Well, all of you were at the bottom, and then the top I thought Kevin yeah. was in the. In the uh, uh, mm, I don't People love her. So. I was in the middle. I don't think so. I wonder if they'll, we'll ever know any of that, if it, they voted for you and if it's on, like, the website. Oh, yeah, like, how close? To who, show how yeah. many votes in second? Get, I bet you, I bet you Cass was in second, to be honest. Oh, yeah. yeah. I bet you it was so Netta. Or Gary, maybe. Netta, people love Gary. Gary. Yeah. People love Gary, too. So what was the deal with uh, Cass and Netta? Cass. Did you guys know of any bad blood? No. People loved Cassandra. Yeah. Like, they loved Cassandra. Yeah, for sure. See, her story is, is interesting, though, because I think at first, people didn't like her. Who? Cassandra in her season. At first? Really? Oh, yeah. I, I know that a lot of people, that they didn't like her, but as the season went on... She became the star. Yeah, she became... Mm. Cassandra. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But at the beginning, I know a lot of people wrote her off and were like, no, we don't like, like no. I know a lot of people did that. Wow. A lot of the fans, a lot of... After, after Mitch went home, I was so upset, but then Cassandra just, like... Yeah, that's when saved the yeah. show and like. Made I like it. I like it. My preseason pick was Ramsey, but when the season started, it was, I was like, "Yeah, Mitch all the way." Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I like Mitch. Yeah. Oh my. But yeah, near the end it was Cassandra. I, I was I was cheering for it near the end for sure. Oh, loved yeah. her. Oh, me too. Yeah. 
Oh, 100%. She was definitely loved. Okay. Like, people thought she was oh, yeah. going to win. Oh, for sure. Oh, 100%. She was more loved than whoever won. Her and Tim, I wanted her and Tim Nick at and the Tim. end. Oh, yeah, Nick and Phil, yeah. Her and Tim at the end, for sure. Mm -hmm. But the ones that made it to the end, I would have preferred Kelsey because she played those boys both sides, and I thought she played a better game. I thought Tim was pretty. Tim was really good. Oh, he was Tim great. Tim was so good. And I loved his personality. Yeah. I was very oh, yeah. interested in seeing him and Cass always. That as a fan, I always wanted to see them. It was like I waited for them. Kelsey and the Pack Boys, not so much. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, like Cassandra's my favorite. Yeah, she's hilarious. But you didn't work with her. No, it was it was. How it she was my favorite, but it just didn't work. It out. is, huh? Some people just. It's not like, that's the thing. When you're at home and you're watching the show, it's like, oh, this person should work with it. That's not how it works. It's just you know that. I know. That's not how. That's just not how the things work. Mm. You know. Yeah, she's my favorite. She was good. She's hilarious. I can't wait to go to Winnipeg and go to Ray and Jerry's with her. Yeah, because you're not too far from her, are you? How far are you? Winnipeg is oh, really yeah, far, Winnipeg, but Bruce yeah. is from Winnipeg. So That's Bruce right. has no problem. Let's go to, we'll go get home, do whatever, and go to Winnipeg. Yeah, I think it's like a 24 hour I didn't know he was from Winnipeg. Bruce was born Actually, and raised probably, in Winnipeg. What Winnipeg's do you mean? Her right and him, she knows the street he grew up on, I told her, and they went to the same high school. Really? That's crazy. They went, Bruce and her went to the same high school. Yeah. Like, she is from that same neighborhood. That's crazy. Like, she knows it well. She loves Winnipeg. Bruce loves Winnipeg. I love Winnipeg. Winnipeg's awesome. It's like Kansas City. It's just really solid, good people. They tell you straight up. Winnipeg. Yes. <laughs> Winnipeg. Winnipeg for me is brown. It's, but I don't know it's anything about It's the people, about not the I'm kidding. atmosphere. <laughs> It's not a beautiful. <laughs> Everyone from there's Winnipeg. some beautiful plot. They no, have beautiful lakes and beaches. Really? Sandy, beautiful. Oh, unbelievable! This Grand Beach, it's amazing. It looks like the ocean. The lake is oh. so beautiful. Oh yeah, and this Assiniboine Park, and and then we go to the drive bridge drive-in and eat ice cream. And oh yeah, Bruce tied his cousin's hair to the rail, left her there. <laughs> oh my goodness! Lots of memories there. Yeah. We go down. Burton Cummings used to beat Bruce up. It was great. Great fun. Yeah. Good time. And there are him. other boys there. I don't know him, of course, but Johnny. there's only him, huh? Yeah, Johnny. Johnny? There's yeah. only Johnny's him and her there. Yeah. And I visited. Oh, Jared. Oh, yeah, Jared, too. He's oh, from Jared's Winnipeg. Jared's there. Yeah. Jared? Yeah. Is that from Alberta? No. no. I think That's he one? works in Alberta in the oil company. Oh, he like, does. But That's I think it was Winnipeg. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, he's, he's. I heard that Cassandra and Gary, or sorry, sorry, Cassandra and Jared, like don't get along. Oh no. 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 Yeah. From that season. From that season, yeah. yeah. That would make sense. Yeah. That's gonna happen. There was so much, already. Crazy. It is crazy to think about. Crazy, crazy. It is absolutely crazy to think about. Day six will still be a day. I remember. Like it just hasn't slowed down. That's your day? Wow. Just the mayhem on day six. The mayhem. Just the running around? Yeah. And then only like uh, we were talking earlier, it's like now you can go in a room and you can be by yourself. But in the first week, you come mm -hmm. in the bathroom, there's five people. You go in the mm -hmm. blue room, there's two people or four people. You go in the pink room, there's four people. Yeah. You go in the kitchen, there's two people. You go Like, there was nowhere to be alone, yeah. you know? And it's very, like, it could be overwhelming. You know what yeah. I mean? There's oh nowhere God, to yeah. be alone. I was overwhelmed all I the time. The first time. Yeah. <clears throat> you know, now you can go, and if you just want time to yourself, you go in one of the bedrooms or you go yeah. wherever, you know? You just mm. sit by yourself, you know? <clears throat> only nine people left. Yeah. It was amazing. And just look, it's only, there's only seven gone. Yeah. And that we're so amazed that we have so much room. It's like seven mm. people is all that's gone. <clears throat> it's almost half. Yeah. Crazy. But still. <clears throat> I hope they cheered Netta. I hope they didn't boo her. Same. When I she think, went out to the <coughs> stage, yeah, they, I they probably they told her, told them to cheer. Yeah, they would have. <coughs> because I've never, 
I've never heard booing from, from the Canadian crowd before. A few times I have. In earlier seasons? Yeah. For what, what people? I'd have to think. There was a few. I've never heard it. I've never heard it. I've, I've never heard it. order and everything yeah. so so and yeah. everybody's mouth went yeah what the fuck yeah and then who named the replacement <laughs> Brittany so Brittany got the power and got the name the replacement yeah. and she said Bruno and you went from totally safe I'm the here for the seventh the next, week yeah. To on the block and out the door in what ten minutes? If that four. So you, your head was spinning like a Tasmanian well, devil. Well, like think think of eviction night. So think of yesterday. I can't even imagine. <clears throat> so think of yes, last, yesterday, okay? Yeah. Cindy and Jackie are on the block, mm -hmm. and we're just waiting to vote. And you're just sitting there on the couch, chill. Yeah. We're just that waiting. Was an to, eviction night. Yeah, it was eviction night. We were wait. We were sitting just like we were last night. <clears throat> so we're sitting there. Arissa comes on. We're just like, okay, <clears throat> you're gonna go vote. And right when we're about to get up to go vote. That's when Brittany stood up. So they had already told you you <coughs> order and everything. Yeah. So you're ready to go. Where was she keeping this? She oh. had those two safe necklaces in her, where, in her pockets in the back or something. She had two necklaces? Two ne yeah, yeah. Two veto necklaces. Yeah. So she could have vetoed both? She could have done one, both, or none if she wanted. So why did she not take Godfrey off? Because she, she knew? She did. She took herself and Godfrey off. And put you? Me and Zach on. Oh. And so nobody got a chance to talk to oh. say two to go home. And because him and Peely and Zach and What's-Her-Face were together, then you knew you would go? I was already gone Kevin, at that Kevin point. Left oh, I did not before, see this. Oh, you before. were gone. I was, I was swimming in the pool in Jury House. Or <laughs> <laughs> I was, he went the week before. I was roasting marshmallows in the backyard of the Jury oh, House. Uh, <clears> so <throat> then who, how, how did the vote go did, down? I was not there. It was unanimous. It was unanimous. Yeah. So I was sitting there, and then next thing I know, I'm... Out the door. Just literally in like so four So no minutes. backpack, no nothing. nothing, 10 minutes, see you later, and you are like, and so then you're on the way to the, are you like bawling? No, no. Crushed? Well, you're disappointed. I mean, it's, it, it sucked. Right? How long did it take you to recover from that? Uh, Couple right. days? Uh, still. <laughs> still <laughs> did. What never, year is it? Yeah, never, is it? The wound is not healed, Karen. No, I'd never be recovered. <laughs> Many what therapy bills that? have <laughs> gone into this. Yeah. I'd never be recovered. <clears throat> nah, that's the way it goes. That's the way it goes. So how did it go down unanimous? I don't know. Who's burning some? I don't know. Nobody had a chance to talk. Nope. It was not the same thing with the Cindy, Dylan, Jackie. Jackie pulled herself off. Yeah. Netta goes up yeah. and none of us talked. Yeah. But you're Did you guys know that we wouldn't vote? How come you didn't vote Dylan? Did you know? Because him? yeah, I, I I knew that I knew that it was and I and I was like Dylan and I were good friends at that point too. But like I knew like That was the, it was gonna be a seven zero or a six one or or up, a five you two. Were like, or, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I was the first one to vote. Yeah, I know you said that. Yeah. I said Kevin go to the diary room. I vote to evict. I paused and I thought about it. Netta. Netta <laughs> <laughs> just erupted. And you were shocked. I was just like, holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> holy <laughs> fuck, what is going on? <laughs> right? I'm telling you, Karen, I was looking at Arissa. Right, <laughs> right by her shoulder, there was this middle-aged man. Like, like my age. Like, like I think older, like gray hair throughout, like just an old man, like this, uh, like this guy should not be a Big Brother fan. When Cindy named the replacement nominee, this old man went like this. And <sighs> like I've never, like it's like his team won the Super Bowl. Like it's, I it saw a woman who was like that. It was, was like, unbelievable. Girl. That tells me. As a player, not as the fan, oh. that I cannot wait to see all of you guys' conversations that they knew oh. we were so down and out that you were just going to oh. clear us out. 
no, that that no. tells me it's like the underdog story that it yeah. was like that no. the tide turned on that move because you saying that that guy was like he was like <laughs> he was 60 years old that's Bruce Singville who doesn't watch the show is like yeah <laughs> that might have been happening in my living room oh he he was probably uh you know what I'm saying yeah exactly <laughs> There's like it was just an explosion. Because remember, I what we weren't in the pantry, but it was me or Dre that was mm -hmm. going up, and then it would have been who would have went home. Say, say, I, Karen and Dylan are sitting there. Who's going home then? I don't, I don't know if you were the option. Yeah, I was. You were the option. Me and Dre. Oh yeah. Netta said, "Just put Karen up." When they were yelling in the pantry. Yes. Yeah. So, <laughs> me and Dylan, who's going? Me. I think they would have. You said Dylan was the, your boy? Yeah, I, I would have voted for Dylan. To, but like, to stay. You guys, I, you guys had the numbers, though. But who, which side? But Dylan had been betrayed. So whose side? Mm -hmm. Like, really? No, Dylan you Dylan would have gone? gone? Yeah, anyway, Dylan would have gone. That's man. what happened. Hmm? I said, anyway, that was net on the block. Yeah, it never happened. So yeah, you know exactly. what? We'll never know. But you think. I think it would have been like I told you. It didn't matter. Just anybody get out so we can recover. Yeah. Damage control. Yeah. Who cares? Just get this over with. Just not me is what I think it was going on in her mind. That because Ika said that she walked in and she goes, "Can we have a moment?" And Ika's like, "No, you can't." Oh really? Oh, Ika was like, "No." No, you can't. And she and then there. She